y'all and welcome to this thimble bell tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to do a slip stitch. A slip stitch is a little different from other crochet stitches because you don't really use it to create a pattern. It's more like a technique that you use to join other elements together or to do like a finishing border on some patterns. First I'm going to show you how to join other elements together. So as you can see I've already created a shell and to join this shell to the rest of my line, I'm going to skip two stitches, insert my hook into the third stitch, yarn over, which is to bring the yarn over your hook so it'll catch, pull through, and that'll give me two loops on my hook. Now, unlike with a single crochet where you would actually yarn over and pull through both, I'm just going to pull the last loop I made through my first loop. And that's how I use a slip stitch to join an element to the rest of my project. As you can see, my shell is now secured. Now let's see how to do that slip stitch again. We're going to insert our hook into a stitch, yarn over, pull through. I got two loops. I'll pull the last loop I made through my first loop. Insert hook, yarn over, pull through, pull the last loop through the first loop. Insert hook, yarn over, pull through, bring the last loop through the first loop. And there you have it folks, that's how you do a slip stitch. I hope this has been a helpful tutorial and if so, please subscribe to the channel or visit my website www.thimblebell.com for more nifty ideas. Thanks so much.